you've been asked to correct to pick the correct derivative we can definitely see that the slope is zero so somewhere right about two I should cross the x-axis on my derivative also I can see I'm almost zero but slightly negative at zero and almost zero slightly positive at four all of these slopes are negative all of these slopes are positive so if I was going to sketch this I would have a zero around two my biggest slope my biggest negative slope is right around one and my biggest positive slope appears to be right around three so if I've got two three and one I'm going to have almost negative at zero to a maximum at one zero at two a maximum at three and almost to zero at four and now as we look that looks just like choice D